if you can get the ripest fruit, the darkest spots, um, add bananas are the best. Here we have pure unsweetened acai frozen, and then we have organic. Hi, egg roll. Hi, egg roll. Giddy, 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 giddy. Hop ups. Cinnamon. See what she does? She puts your paw in there and digs to try to get some out the top of the big barrel, and I'm like, what are you doing? I think she was a squirrel on another life, I swear to God. So, yeah. This is what I'm working on right now. And, um, bananas, acai, apples, water, did I say apples? I said apples, but I mean ice and water. Here we go. Where did I get apples from? I guess I need to put an apple in there, right? My mind's saying apple. My mouth is. Make <sighs> sure your apples are clean, organic, and because I'm going to use my little tiny bullet thing, I'm going to, which is not the name of this. This is just like a GE product. Very basic. $19.95, I think that's how much it was. And, um, and it works great. See? I have two of those. I started off with my first one. And I'm pretty much burned it up. Burned it up, burned it up. This is from Kathy from San Antonio. My name is Kathy. And I've been going raw. Um, I don't think I'm an 80 10 10 person, per se. I started off with a juice drink in the morning on my own. And then I just started Googling and trying to figure out what else to do. Because there's always this next step that you want that your body takes. And mine was, is there anybody else out there doing the same thing I'm doing? Well, truthfully, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> I am so clogged up, I couldn't barely sleep last night. Um, so I went from just my thing in the morning, juicing. Not even juicing, like I'm saying, step by step, was <sighs> trying to figure out what would the next, what is the next step for my body, besides just waking up, putting some fruit in a little tiny blender with ice, and at the time I was using fat-free milk or skin milk, skin milk, because it was really clear. Um, I got off whole milk, God, years and years and years ago, so. Wash my hands. So, um, but the next step was trying to figure out is there anybody else out there like me who's doing what? And, and got this really great soap. Um, I feel like I'm trying to breathe right now. I'm just trying to breathe, guys. Um, and I was Googling, not only did I find that there was a hole population out there, people doing this, and more, and more, and more, and more. Look at the guys with the 30 bananas a day. Or, uh, what is his name? He's a beautiful accent. <clears throat> I mean, and then you find Dan McDonald, who takes it this other step, this great step of, woo, he does everything to the max. And he is great to learn from, to step out with. He is a man of his time. Before his time, that's what I call it. A guy before his time. Dan McDonald. Now he's got his own song. But two guys. Two guys wrote. Woo! I almost took off my toe. <laughs> I mean, like my friend Dawn's mom. She was mowing the yard. I think we were in Europe when she did it. And for somehow, some way, she took off her toes. Isn't that odd? Weird. Like I said, ripe bananas. The riper, the better. And then um, we'll start blending this up really quick. And then you add more to it. Or I might go to the, um, I always put more in here if I need. Good luck, right? This little one? Like I said, I have two machines. Okay, let me find the other machine. Live from San Antonio. 
This is called this is called Cooks. It's a different one. But I call them all a bullet. Just because I think that's the first thing I've seen on TV. They call it a bullet. It comes with a whole bunch of cups and please start. of room for more. It's just like a banana a banana shake, I tell you, a banana smoothie. Jeez, guys. Cut out fresh and clean. And if you don't like bananas, apples, anything, just start out simple and cheap. Because I wasn't sure how long I could last just eating fruits and vegetables and taking meat out of my diet and or <sighs> any kind of processed meat. Any meat. And I'm not talking baloney. Yes, I am talking blue. You know what I'm trying to say is even, I'm not just talking roast chickens, roast turkeys and hams, and I'm talking bacon and bologna and sandwich meat. You know, going to a dietitian for the first time, there was a big X over the, um, di uh, what is that word? I can't think of the damn word. Deli? Yeah, the deli. I've worked in delis before. The deli, there was always a big X over the deli. Stay away from the delis. And that's until you lose some weight. Well, you know what? <laughs> Stay away from the delis. Well, there's a reason why they were teaching you that. And so, you know, even if you lose some weight and get everything under control, like your sugar or your diabetes or whatever, we're talking here. More apple with a little bit of peel. Um, and I'm going to open up the acai. Uh, it's not just giving up all the big meats. It's the fake meats, too, like with the processed meats with the fillers and the dyes. And, um, Jesus, what else is in there? I mean, what do they always say about hot dogs? It's just pieces behind. Ugh. What got me to the point about changing my diet, besides watching, um, that documentary, well, there's a couple of them, was, uh, which you can look up some of my other videos, because I talk about those documentaries and other videos. Right now, I'm brain dead. Uh, what was the one? Fat, fat, sick, and nearly dying. Or something like that to that point. Okay, acai, frozen. They're berries. Usually I put blueberries in here, too, to start my day. All right, we have a house phone ringing, as usual. Yeah, hello. 